Hey guys, how's it going? Well, I just got on, I was just on Facebook Live and did like a 20 minute um, lesson, 20 minute spell about uh, what I'm going to talk to you about now. Um, so knowing that people don't want to really watch 20 minute videos, uh, I'm going to try to do this in under four minutes. Okay, so wish me luck. <laughs> uh, I've been enamored by John the Baptist uh, in Luke chapter 7 this week. And, um... What we see here is John the Baptist who baptized Jesus. And then after he baptized Jesus, Jesus went out to the wilderness. They probably lost touch because, you know, there was no uh, cell phones or social medias. Uh, he's John the Baptist, his disciples, the people who's following John the Baptist, is heard all these good things. This is in Luke chapter 7 about uh, this guy healing and, and fixing sight and fixing hearing and raising people from the dead and all this other stuff. Well, John the Baptist told a couple of disciples, go, 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 go to him. And in fact, in verse 9 it says, go to the Lord. So it said, like, go to this man and figure it out. He said, go to the Lord. He, John the Baptist already knew what was going on and asked him this question. Are you the one who is to come or should we look for someone else? Well, Jesus basically said a long yes and one of my favorite verses in this one is verse 23 and anyone who is not offended because of me is blessed people who are healed because of Jesus probably wasn't offended they were probably very grateful and they were definitely very blessed a lot of healing comes from his faith okay John the Baptist was eager to share Jesus with others he was a dynamic preacher he's baptizing people all the all the way, all the time he had the disciples. So three takeaways in this verse in Luke chapter, in these verses in Luke chapter seven. Uh, I read, uh, I was reading eighteen through twenty-three um, this week. Is allow others to seek Jesus uh, themselves. Allow others to seek Jesus. John the Baptist sent his disciples to go talk to him. It wasn't John the Baptist. John the Baptist knew what was going on. John the Baptist sent his disciples. The next thing is, tell others about God. That's exactly what John the Baptist did, but allow them to make their own decisions. It's very important for us just to tell others about God. And they have to make their own decisions. Once you tell people about Jesus, you're, you're tough done until God doesn't give that opportunity anymore. Keep telling them. Keep, keep telling them. And then they will have, they have to make their own decisions. And John the Baptist's uh, his, his 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 desire to share God was so authentic and so enthusiastic. Is we need to try to strive for that enthusiasm. Try to strive for that enthusiasm of sharing God with others and just being there for people and being there for friends and finding situations where they can go. Hey, go talk to this guy. Or hey, this is what Jesus looks like. That's what John the Baptist did. And that's what we should be doing too, guys. All right. Hey, see y'all later. Steve Austin says, because Stone Cold said so. Later, guys.